A report says that Tesla Motors is developing a self-driving car. With all the buzz over autonomous automobiles these days, among other automakers currently in the race, Nissan pledging that it will bring self-driving cars to the market within a decade. Tesla Motors working on its own. Let's check in with award-winning host, television host, broadcaster, and host of the popular weekend talk show, The Drive with Alan Taylor, Alan Taylor. This is getting fast and exciting too, Alan, isn't it? You know, um, I got to say, I drove, I went over again today and drove the Tesla Model S again just to refresh as I knew I was going to be on your show. And I got to say, this guy has made, Elon Musk has made an amazing machine. It's no wonder Motor Trend gave it the uh, 2013 car of the year. It's, it's an amazing machine. How, how, does it, how does it run by itself? What does it do? Well, you know, the ones they have right now don't. And even Elon Musk says that, you know, you still have to have a driver in the car. It won't just, uh, you know, go off and do things by itself. Um, although Audi has made a car that will go park itself. It'll let you out and then go find a parking space. <laughs> so, uh, you know, it's, it's really not far down the road that we'll have cars like that. But I, I also just recently drove the new Mercedes E-Class, the 2014 that's coming out. And this car will do a lot of the same things that the uh, Tesla Model S will do right now, which is it'll stop itself if you have it on distronic cruise control um, and the car in front of you stops and you're not paying attention, the car will stop itself. Um, and they have lane departure warning system. The cars will be safer, George. I'm telling you, I've experienced it. I've been in the, the behind the seat. We went to uh, Germany with um, Conti Continental, which is the manufacturer of a lot of the electronics. And they said, go ahead, try and crash it. it. The car won't let you. It's amazing. Alan, right now, of course, in this country, the legal the drunk limit is 0. .08. If someone gets in an automatic car, a car that drives itself, and he or she has been drinking, can they still get a ticket? Not They're not driving? You know, I was talking to Jay Leno about that just the other day, and Jay says, yeah, what happens if you run into a bunch of nuns walking across the street and you're not even driving the car? It boils down to that's why it'll take until 2020 for a lot of this technology to be available is because of the lawyers. Right now, there's already a big yeah. lawyer screen when you use your navigation system, and your car won't let you, you know, put in a new address while you're moving. So they, they're going to have plenty of safeguards, and that's, that's some of the questions that still are yet to be answered, George. Alan, uh, where can people uh, listen to you to, to your show, The Drive? Well, it's, uh, you know, it's all over, and thank God I'm actually talking to you right now uh, through the connected dashboard of a Chrysler 300 and their Uconnect system. <laughs> so you can find us anytime online. Um, we're, we're part of uh, a lot of these online systems like uh, iHeartRadio, podcast okay. anytime, The Drive with Alan Taylor. You got it. Alan, thanks. And let's keep our eyes on this kind of technology. I, I find that fascinating. 